Gifts from God are precious treasures. They are given to us not just for our benefit, but for the edification of others and the glory of God. However, like any treasure, a gift must be preserved, nurtured, and guarded. Today, we'll explore three biblical ways to preserve a gift given to you by God. 1. Develop and cultivate the gift. God calls us not only to receive His gifts, but to develop them. When Paul urged Timothy to stir up the gift, he was reminding him that it takes effort and intentionality to keep a gift active and effective. Just like a fire needs to be stirred to burn brightly, our gifts require nurturing and development. Practical Steps Study and Practice If you have a teaching gift, immerse yourself in the Word of God. If you are gifted musically, practice diligently to improve your skill. Seek Knowledge Proverbs 4.7 says, Wisdom is the principal thing, therefore, get wisdom. Invest in learning, attend workshops, and seek to grow in your area of gifting. Surround yourself with mentors. Proverbs 27.17 says, As iron sharpens iron, so one person sharpens another. Find mentors who have walked the path before you. Learn from their experiences, ask questions, and let their wisdom sharpen your abilities. 2. Remain humble and depend on God. One of the biggest threats to preserving a gift is pride. The enemy will tempt you to believe that the gift is yours alone, that you deserve the glory. But remember that the source of the gift is God. It's His grace that enabled you to receive and use it. Humility keeps you connected to the source of your strength. Practical Steps Pray for guidance. Psalm 25.9 tells us, He guides the humble in what is right and teaches them His way. Regularly pray and ask God for wisdom on how to use your gift for His purpose. Remain teachable. No matter how skilled or anointed you become, there is always room for growth. Be open to correction and instruction from the Holy Spirit and godly leaders. Glorify God, not yourself. Always remember that the gift is for God's glory, not your own. When people commend you for your gift, redirect the praise to God. 3. Use the gift for God's glory and the benefit of others. A gift unused is a gift wasted. God has called us to be stewards of His grace, using our gifts to serve others. When we hide or misuse our gifts, we fail in our responsibility. Preserving a gift means putting it into action and being faithful with what God has entrusted to us. Practical Steps Serve faithfully. Find ways to use your gift within your community, church, or wherever God has placed you. Whether it's preaching, teaching, encouraging, or serving, your gift is meant to be a blessing to others. Share Testimonies Revelation 12.11 says, And they overcame him by the blood of the Lamb and by the word of their testimony. Share how God is using your gift to impact lives, encouraging others to trust God with their gifts. Be accountable. Have people in your life who will hold you accountable for using your gift faithfully and for the right reasons. Accountability keeps us humble and ensures that our gifts are preserved for God's purpose. Beloved, God has placed unique gifts within each of us. To preserve these gifts, we must be intentional, cultivating them, remaining humble, and using them for His glory. Remember the parable of the talents, Matthew 25, 14 to 30. The servant who hid his talent lost it, but those who used and invested theirs received more. Let's be faithful stewards, using and preserving what God has entrusted to us.